Hiya, Sam. I'm Soph, and today we're going to be talking about food trucks, but more about that after news and announcements. Two upstate medical university police officers were honored Wednesday for protecting a pastor, Marcus Jackson. When a shooting occurred on July 5th, Pastor Marcus Jackson was shot outside Upstate University Hospital while he was volunteering to help people affected by another shooting. Earlier that same night, at the time of the shooting, Officer Brian Patterson took action. He got right in front, like right in the line of fire. If somebody was shooting at that door, he would have taken it to protect me, said Jackson. Officer Patterson said, you don't have time to think of this sort in this sort of situation, and your training just kicks in. The actual the actor Will Garrison, at age 57, died due to pancreatic cancer. He was known for his role in Sex and the City. His son confirmed Garrison's passing on September 21, 2021. The actor will be missed by many. According to documents filled, filed yesterday, former Minneapolis police officer Derek Chauvin, who was convicted of murder in George Floyd's death, intends to appeal both his convictions and sentencing. Chauvin has said that he intends to appeal on 14 grounds. He claims Judge Peter Chahill abused his judgment when he denied Chauvin's request for the trial of Hennepin County. Chauvin has 90 days from the time of his sentencing to file a notice that he's planning to appeal. And in addition to that, he's also filed a motion to put the process on hold until Supreme Court reviews the previous decision to deny him and a public defender to represent him in the appeal. Please to him for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Next week is Spirit Week. We have Music Monday, Tropical Tourist Tuesday, Color Wars Wednesday, Seniors Black, Juniors White, Sophomores Pink, and Freshmen Blue. Throwback Thursday, the seniors will be 80s, the juniors will be 1000s, the sophomores will be 90s, and the freshmen will be 70s. And Friday will be Orange and Blue Friday. Interested in hiking and camping and learning about awesome outdoor activities? The Outdoor Adventure Club at ESM is definitely for you. OAK cons trips consist of day hikes, overnight camping, cross-country skiing, snowboarding, and many other exciting activities. Come to our first meeting September 30th at 325 in room D17. See Mr. Harrington with any questions. Google Classroom code is F6W7UM7. Now we're going to move on to the food truck segment with Lena and Nicole. So Lena, what are you doing this weekend? Nothing much. I was thinking about going to the food truck battle. Oh, well, that sounds fun. Tell me about it. It's this big event the fairgrounds are hosting. There's like 40-some food trucks from Syracuse and Rochester, and they're going head-to-head. -head. Like crashing into each other? <laughs> no, like a food competition. They've got celebrity judges and everything. Oh, okay. How much does it cost? There's a $5 entry fee, and each food truck will have a different price for affordable samples. Well, what kind of food will be there? They'll have different pizza, ice cream, and barbecue trucks. Sounds like fun. What time will it be? All day, 11 to 8. All right. Will I see you there? Sure will. Today is going to be mostly sunny and a little cool with a high of 67 and a low of 51 degrees. This Saturday will be a little warmer than today with a high of 75 and a low of 54. Sunday is going to be chilly and cloudy with a chance of rain. There's also going to be a high of 67 and a low of 53. And I'm Paige with your weather. So, I've actually never been to a food truck. What's it like? Oh, I love food trucks. My family likes to go to the smaller food truck events they have at the parking lot of Great Northern Mall. That sounds fun. I've only been to one food truck when I was in Niagara Falls. What did you get? I think I got, like, nachos or something. Hmm. Speaking of nachos, I heard they have really good nachos at the Dome. Speaking of sports... <laughs> The 
The ESM girls cross country team beat Syracuse West at Auburn Wednesday night, 16 to 39. They lost to Auburn 31 to 23. The girls were led by Rachel Ladd with a time of 21:31. Taylor Hoffman, Ainsley McKenna, Elena Vespi, Ava Zalens, and Brianna Warner contributed to the win. The boys team also beat Syracuse West with a score of 22 to 33, and they also lost to Auburn 39 to 16. The boys were led by Tommy Walters. Personal bests were achieved by Rowan Buck and Victor Rodriguez, scoring for the Spartans Tommy Walters, John Corsi, Joe, Joe Pedreso Garcia, Sol Schofield, and Brandon Solanka. Solanchik, sorry. The gymnastics team lost against JD with a score of 130.4 to 140. Rhiannon Bushko scored her second 9.0 on the floor this season. Rhiannon also tally, tallied over 29 points in the all-around. Mallory Kramer added nearly 15 points on floor and vault. The, the girls' varsity soccer team beat Oswego 4-0. Leah Redham led the team with two goals and two assists. Angelina Polcaro and Natalie Peterson both had one goal, and Chloe Welch had an assist. The boys' varsity soccer team beat Oswego 6-0. Joel Alvarez and Garrett O'Donnell both led the team with two goals. Todd Durantini had a goal and an assist. Armin Osmanovic had a goal. Eric Marker and Zach Schufelt both had assists. Boys' volleyball defeated Central Square 3-0 last night. They were led by senior setter Jake Franklin, who had 28 assists. Both Aiden Betts and Ben Clappen each had 10 kills to contribute in the win. The Carolina Panthers stay undefeated after winning against the Houston Texans 24-9. And in upcoming games, the tennis team plays against Auburn at 4.30. Both golf teams play at Cortland at 3.30. The girls' varsity soccer team plays Baldwin Baldwinsville at 9. Varsity football plays against West Genesee at home tonight at 6.30. The theme for the game is Red Out. And I'm John with your sports. Well, that's all we have for you today. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Soph with Elena and Nicole. Have a great day, Spartans.